Hey, YouTube fam. It's your girl, Lisa from our gray house. What? There's socks. Bye, socks. Nope, not coming outside. Nope. Nope, not gonna do it. My cats are not outside cats. They are inside cats. So, um, yeah, I forgot to end yesterday's vlog, so I just did that. And now, we're gonna start our day. I have to go to the Homeowners Association because I'm still managing it. So I gotta do a drive-by just to make sure that the property's still in good condition, all that kind of stuff. And then, I'm gonna go to get hot chocolate <laughs> for use. And I'm gonna stop by the house. I found, I'll show you guys when I get to the office, but I found the bedspread I'm gonna buy. It's from Bed Bath & Beyond, you can go look it up now. It's a dark gray, possibly black, but I think it's dark gray, like really dark gray, velvet, like bedspread. Ah, I love it. And they say that velvet is pretty good for cats. Like if you have cats in the house and they're like trying to scratch and claw, that velvet is a good option. So I'm like, mm. and it looks pretty. So uh, I don't really care about the bread bedspread as much, but as I was looking at bedspreads, I'm like, I can't find anything that I like, that I want. So this black velvet one or dark gray or whatever color it is, I'll show you when I get to the office. Hey y'all. Hey, hey friends. Got to get all comfy in my seat. Remember when Darius Rucker was with the Hootie and the Blowfish people? Okay. So I'm on my way to work. Just did the drive-by. Trying not to touch my eyes. Trying not to touch my eyes. I did take another allergy pill because I couldn't find the allergy medicine yesterday. Um, my allergy, like my Zyrtex. So. I'm at 56%. What up? I was doing Marco Polo with the girls this morning. So, my triplets. And, yeah. So, my battery life was running down. Anyways. I did the drive-by. The house looks fine. And now I'm on my way to the office. Got my Starbucks hot chocolate venti. And they saw me coming in and they started making it. Because I'm a... I frequent that location a lot. Um... And I'm gonna stop by the house. It's kind of misty outside, like, uh, so I don't know. I'm not gonna stay too long because I got things to do today. I got things to do today. I'm gonna buy, I told you guys, I found that bed cover, that uh, bed cover, <laughs> comforter. I don't know what you call it. Bed spread? I think it's bed spread. Found the bed spread at Bed Bath and Beyond, but I'll show you guys before I order it and the other things I'm con contemplating ordering. <laughs> All right, let's go have an awesome day. Hey guys, so now I'm at work and um, I was gonna show you really quick the things that I was gonna order. So this is the first thing that I was thinking about buying. It's on sale for $224. It's a big ottoman. And as you can see, it shows up with a gray couch. And so I thought, well, we're gonna have a gray couch, great couch, so that will work. And then it says ottoman measures, blah, blah, blah. But it has dark espresso ornate finished legs and our furniture is espresso, so that would be great. Natural linen upholstery. Um, doesn't really say what color the linen is, but it looks like it goes with the gray in this picture, so that would be awesome. And see, it looks almost like it has like an off-white grayish tint to it. Not a super big fan of this, but you know, whatever. The next thing that I was thinking about buying was this mid-century modern black bench. Uh, we don't really have like all of our stuff is just an eclectic mix of styles and such, but this is on sale for $160.99 and you can purchase it in store. But I was trying to look at the, it's a painted black finish, which a lot of our stuff is either that dark espresso color or black. But I was trying to see these dimensions to see how it would fit in the foyer because it's in the foyer as you first walk in the door. And the other thing I was thinking about buying was this to go above it. Um, because I had seen a picture of it with it above it somewhere. I don't know where. Where was it? I don't know. I'll try to find the picture. But anyway, I thought that would look nice above the bench. Last but not least, looking at this desk for my office. I want something small and simple. It's on sale for $142.49 got the silver 
on there that I like. Simple. I'm not going to be doing a whole lot, but look. And I thought, oh, I could get like a green chair or something to go with it. Yeah. Might be getting that too. Okay, it's kind of like misting more than it was earlier. So I basically have stayed at my desk the whole day. I've gotten a ton of things done, so that feels good. But now it's gotten colder, but it wasn't supposed to get colder till the weekend. And I'm like freezing and I didn't bring a jacket. So I'm gonna run home, grab a jacket, pick up Marvin, and then we're gonna go to dinner. Hey, casting crew. It's 11. Actually, it's after 11 o'clock. And I'm still up. I am browsing furniture. But I don't know if I told you the fantastic deal I got today. If I did, I will pause right here and I'll cut it out. A couple of days ago, I found an ottoman online that I was going to purchase for our living room. I'd seen a picture of a gray couch and it was a light colored, I think linen, natural colored ottoman. And it was square and it was like tufted. So it was cute. Our only concern is that the cats are gonna get on it because it's like colored and they're dark colored cats and they'll get hair all over it. But we have this Sherpa blanket that they're laying on right now that we can lay on top of the ottoman. And then when folks come over, we can take that off and then it'll be fine. Anyway, that was a couple of days ago and I found that I found it at Kirkland's. It was originally $2.99 and it was on sale for $2.25. And I thought, Psh, that's a fantastic deal. I mean, sounds good to me. So then I was going on the Bed Bath & Beyond website today looking for something else. I was actually looking for that velvet bedspread. I think I told you guys this. I don't know. But anyway, so I was looking at that and I thought, well, let me see what kind of ottomans they have for my office. I was looking for my office. Lo and behold, I click on ottomans and there pops up the exact same one I saw at Kirkland's. At... Guys, guys, hey, hey, hey. The one other fighting. Ooh, he's getting rough. Anyway, the one at Kirkland's is called the Charlotte. I'm I'm telling you guys, literally the exact same one. The one at Kirkland's was called the Charlotte, and the one at Bed Bath & Beyond was called the Isabel. I don't care what you call me, just don't call me late for dinner. We're getting the Isabel. So anyway, it was $175 at Bed Bath & Beyond. Okay, so then I'm thinking... Dang, I'm already saving 50 bucks. So I go on Bed Bath and & Beyond. And by the way, I went to Ebates first. And if you guys haven't checked out Ebates, it's the link's in my description box below. But I always go to Ebates first, and then I go to the store. Because then I can earn cash back. In fact, this last check that I got from Ebates, because you get one like once a quarter. This last check that I got was like for $120 or $140 or something. Now, granted that covered Christmas, but still, that's a pretty hefty sum. Anyway, so as it turns out on the Bed Bath & Beyond site, if you join their Bed Bath & Beyond plus Super Secret Club, Duper Club, I don't know what it's called, but it's some sort of like membership thing. It's a once a year fee for $29, you'll get 20% off. And I was like, okay. I don't plan on buying a whole lot more, but I figured it out and 20% off of the stuff that I was buying was going to be more than the cost of the membership and so and still some so i'd save money so anyway i got hey guys i got to the checkout and i had saved 69 dollars total so minus the 30 dollars that i put for the best buy super duper club i still saved 39 dollars and it was free shipping y'all i'm saying that's a deal I don't care who you are, I don't care where you live, that is a deal. So, I was very, very happy with that. And so that was the, I, so far we've purchased the ottoman, I purchased a new bed spread for our bed, and I purchased, I think that was it really for that part. Oh, and we had to take the Kirkland's, the mirror back to Kirkland's because it broke. Hoping they have another one in stock so we can just get one right away. But if not, I guess we'll order it. I still have to go and order furniture. Uh, we're ordering a couch probably and a love seat. And possibly the little corner chair thing. I don't know. We already got the ottoman ordered. And I think for the living room we were thinking about ordering like some sort of rug. But really not sure what we want. And then for the... 
What else? <sighs> I can't think. Oh, dining room table and chairs, and we need four bar stools. And then that'll round out the living room and kitchen. So for my office, I'm gonna get a white desk, a sort of small one, and I'm going to get a chair, but the kind of chair, let me see if I have the picture close by. I mean, close by like, I mean, yeah, my computer's right here, so it's relatively close, but I was gonna see if the design that I was thinking of, because I had seen some pictures of some chairs that I liked, and, okay, so hold on while I look. In my office, I have a dark gray carpet, so I thought, hey, this would be like a fun color, and it kind of plays off the color of our front door, which I thought I'd put pops of color of that throughout the house. But anyway, so that's, that's one idea. But then I thought, well, what if I do this chair, which I think is super cute, and then I do a teal colored like ottoman. And so here's another option for a blush pink chair. Oh, and here's another one, um, another option, although I don't like that as much. And then here is an even better option. I really like this because I would have a white desk and then I would have this pink chair. Okay, so here are the ottomans. Sorry, got distracted. I really kind of like that. I like this one a lot. And then we have, that one's kind of the same thing. That one's cute, that one's nice. I really wanted to play off the front door color though, so these are so hard to tell like what color they actually are in person. But see, like this one has a gray, I mean, it's not gonna be by a gray catch, but I'm just saying it looks pretty. The desk is gonna be white and it's gonna be kind of in the corner of the room. And I thought by the window, I could put my full length mirror so I could, in case I want to show you guys my outfits <laughs> and I could put that little, little sort of biggish ottoman kind of like right over there, just kind of like decorating the space. And if I do a teal green ottoman, because I originally thought to do a pink ottoman and teal green chair, but now I'm thinking doing teal green chair and doing pink ottoman because like if I'm doing like filming and I'm at my desk, I think the teal green would be a prettier, like it would help bring out my eyes maybe. I don't know. I'm just kind of going back and forth on teal green chair or pink chair, teal green ottoman or pink ottoman. I don't know. But I have, of course, the color swatch from when we painted the front door. And then I can take that with me to search, like if I can go to the store in person and search for fabrics. So also for the office, I need the, I need the desk for the office. I need an office chair. I need the ottoman. I already have a mirror, although I kind of want a bigger one, but anyway, whatever. I also need a full length mirror for the master, so try not to smell like buku's of money, but you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and then um, try to be frugal and thrifty. What else did I need? So for the office, I also needed like just one, I'm trying to keep it to one um, filing cabinet so we can put our important documents in there. And then I don't really need anything else for the office because they already have stuff. And then of course I have some miscellaneous decor anyway, just stuff that I've either had or purchased. And so I'm hoping that some of my really great friends at decorating will help me choose the items and where to put this item or that item to kind of make everything look cohesive and like it fits together and like I did it on purpose. Cause a lot of times it's like, what was with the lights off when you decorated over here? Cause that doesn't go together. Anyway, um, for the kitchen living room, we need four bar stools. We need a couch. We need a dining room table and chairs. And so we already bought the ottoman. In the master, we don't need anything because I have bought the bedspread now. We already had, um, I was thinking about getting another bench. I don't know. I just don't want to spend too much money, but I also want some new things. So. And we need a guest bed and nightstand, at least one, if not more. And then, so anyway, I'm gonna go to, oh, sorry guys, I'm so tired. We're gonna go to, I'm gonna go to the store tomorrow. Probably, I don't know, cause it's gonna be cold tomorrow. <laughs> I don't wanna go anywhere. Oh, and I just found out. I don't know where that cut me off. So, anyway, I'm, 
probably boring myself. But I need to go to bed now because I have a full day tomorrow. I said I was gonna go, I was trying to tell you guys, oh, maybe I'll go to the store tomorrow. But tomorrow's supposed to be cold and I've got a lunch appointment at 11. And then after that, I might just come home. I've got stuff to do, y'all, but trying to wrap up working that HOA that I was helping manage because I uh, had a talk with my broker last night or tonight and I said, look, I'm kind of like done. So let's, let's wrap this up. I don't want to do this anymore. And I don't want to pass off just junk to somebody else, but also I don't want to do this anymore. And I need to focus on some of my other files. I have a lot going on real estate wise. And so anyway, that's, I keep saying anyway, anyway, so anyway, <laughs> is that like a drinking game every time Lisa says so anyway so anyway all right I'm gonna end this vlog here and I will see you guys tomorrow bye